we were checking here for suspected blown cylinder. Um, so we went ahead and disconnected our hoses. We're replacing hoses, so I have hose pull fittings on the hoses. Um, we've gone ahead and capped off our cylinder hose hose fittings here. The cylinder is fully purged, and what we're doing now is seeing if we get movement. So the rest of the steering system has been isolated. Disconnected our tie bar here from the port motor. And again, this is a dual cylinder uh, with steel tie bar uh, set up. And uh, we're getting a lot of play in the steering and it's, uh, it's wandering off course on autopilot. Okay, so all I'm doing now is we got a blown piston in here. Again, cylinder's full of fluid. If the cylinder's working good and everything's in good shape, you got rose fittings capped off here. This thing shouldn't budge at all. Um, but as you're going to see here in a minute, it's going to slide right on over to, to the starboard side of it, and that confirms a blown cylinder or a blown piston. So now that's confirmed, and what I'm going to do is go check the rest of the steering system on the boat and make sure everything else is performing to spec. But for sure, that cylinder's got to be replaced. 